So I want to take a minute and start of this and just say thank you guys for making this series a big one. Uh, you know, it's every now and then there's a game that comes out, and when I'm playing it at the start, I, I don't know where I came up with this whole, like, upload schedule system type thing, but I... I guess I just care about this stuff so much over the years, um, I don't want to ever take it for granted. So thank you guys for putting me in a position where I'm able to make these kinds of videos, you know. So, uh, I love you guys. All the support, all the likes really means a lot to me. Keep it up if you want more of this game. Uh, several parts each day until we get to the end of the story. And then I may do a review afterwards. I don't know yet. Um, but I love you guys. Let's get this. Alright guys, welcome back. I'm not sure if it's a brand new video or what, but anyways, we just got here. We had a little bit of a capsize issue. Boat went overboard like Truman Show over there. Uh, so we're gonna keep going. I don't know. This area looks like it's probably the coolest area in the game. Finally reaching the aquarium. Hopefully we get to uh, see Abby at least. Get some kind of revenge maybe. I don't know. We'll see. Now, this area of the game has been my favorite. The last, like, hour or so, the last couple of videos, you're at the arcade, fighting everything. Let me see what I have right now. Let me double check. I took a little break between the last video and this one. Uh, we're good. Used quite a bit of stuff when we fought the... We fought that bloater, I think it was what it was called. Yeah, this area looks awesome. And it's all deserted. It's kind of exciting, honestly. This feels like in-game territory, you know what I mean? <laughs> Yo, check it out. Little water park where little kids can ride on the shark. Nice. Seahorses, let's get it. Okay. I'm gonna look around really quick. I know we're trying to find her, but I already know there's gonna be something down here that I... That's probably hidden, you know what I mean? I just had some sushi. I actually was, I was gonna go for a run, and like, I just blacked out. <laughs> I was like laying on my couch, and I was listening to music, and all of a sudden it just, it just hit me. Right, we already came through here, so, alright, let's just go ahead and go straight in. Full circle, let's get it. I've really enjoyed uploading these videos, I've been, I wouldn't say I've been like, overloading myself, but I have been recording a lot more than I usually do. Uh, when there's not a lot of new games coming out, I just, I don't know, I've just been kind of like doing one video here and there, but with this game in particular, I'm just dying to get to the end, you know what I mean? Alright, let's get going. Everything's locked. What about this? Ooh, sliding door. Almost! Let's try to see if we can find a way in. It's two doors that have been locked. Wait, what is this? Nice. Uh, that's gonna give me one of the one of these. I like this a lot. Oh wait, I could craft something else. Uh, but what? Oh, it's this. It shouldn't count as like, hey, you can craft something. Oh, I can get this though. Hold on. Let's get it. More effective, and next time we get the smoke bombs. Let's get it. That is awesome. This has to be the right way, yeah. Authorized personnel only. We'll see about that. Are we going up, it looks like? Looks like we are, but let me just double check this corner back here. Could be a rag. I definitely want to get some more materials right now. That boss fight kind of I don't have any, any rags or bottles right now, you know? Or it's just a canister, I think is what it was technically called. Well, there's a shark. Uh, are we going to hop in here or what? That's pretty cool. I, I love the set pieces like this, you know, like... The vibe here is really awesome. Why would she be hiding here, though? You know? Seems kind of odd. I'll look around, make sure there's not anything hidden, you know? Might find a rag here and there. Maybe, like, you can hop back here? Oh. Well, here we go, then. What does this say? Cleaning schedule. 
Oh, it shows like shrimp. Stuff like that. Okay. Plankton. Yep. If this is a hiding spot. This is kind of a weird one. You know what I mean? Oh, let's get it. Rags? We're not... Okay, let's go ahead and just save it. Can't make anything yet, so we'll just take it easy. That's what I was kind of hoping to find. Just a little bit of top-off action. You know what I mean? Nothing over here. Looks like it'd be like some pills or something there. Well, this looks kind of... Kind of rough over here. I don't know. Alright, let's get going. I've really enjoyed playing this game, like, the gameplay-wise, and just... I think just making the videos in general have been actually fun. You know, ever since we got to, like, the Seattle area, it's just been a lot of fun. Uh, the prologue was nice up until a certain point, you know, <laughs> but I think for everything else, though, it just, it, like, all the little areas we've been to have been fun. Sometimes the enemies can kind of get repetitive, but uh, for the most part, it's been a pretty good variety. Fighting, like, the scars at one point, you know. The whistling that they do is pretty intense. Yo, this is really quiet down here. Getting a little bit nervous. Can you break... <laughs> The window? No, you can't. All right. I just feel like Abby's gonna hop out at any minute and take me down. I'm nervous, yo. Oh, what we got? Nice. More rags. Let's get it. Uh, that should put me. I'm really close. Going to make one of those. Want to get my med kits back up, but I know that I probably shouldn't just use it immediately. Uh, I think we're good. All right, let's, I'm, I'm act, I mean, I could run through here, but I'd rather kind of walk slowly. <laughs> Just make sure I don't miss anything. Where the fuck are you? Um, all right, let's check over here. Nothing. All right, let's get going. Look up somewhere. Maybe we gotta hop up somewhere and climb through. Uh, no, I guess not. Wait a minute. Here we go. Here we go. Always another route. The level design in this game is really good. I, I mean, I'm trying to find the positives and everything. Like the gameplay is is top top notch. It's just, I think a lot of people are just upset with the way the story is so far. Yo, if a jump scare happens, I'm throwing my controller. It actually will come disconnected. Jesus. What the hell? Jesus. I hate that. Poor dog. No, he's still moving. Stupid dog. Well, you know, I take my dogs up and down flights of stairs every day to take them outside to go potty. So it's like, <laughs> I, I'm just, I have a soft spot. I really do. I thought when I had a daughter, like that would, it would change up. My heart just grew bigger. I think that's all it was. What is this? God. What fuck happened here? What kind of torture is this? All right, let's get this. Uh, I just have to stay hydrated when I make videos, by the way. Gotta go through there. Okay, let's check everything else. Uh, scissor. Up oh, here we go. More stuff and rags. Let's get it, man. That's the last crafting one I can need there. Let's see. Uh, we need more rags for this. Arrows, everything else is good. Suppressor's good. Or the silence, or whatever you want to call it. Um, let's check back here. Uh, bottle, which that actually... Okay, that puts me in a full one, I think. But I think I already had that. There it goes, man. So, you have to hurt a dog. 
Like, there's no way to avoid what just happened. You would actually have to take that dog down. So if you wanted to go the whole game as Ellie and not hurt any animals, it forces you to do it, you know? You know, I swear, if I get jumped... Hold on, let me little... Check this out. Hold on. Let's see what's back here. I'm gonna assume... Oh, there's muffled voices. Okay, let's check over here first. We'll check in this room, make sure we grab everything, and then we'll roll out with the top back. All right, let's see. Carrots. So this place, like, somebody's here, and you know who it is. What is in here? Owen Moore. Flip. Owen. Really? Hmm. I said guy that was with her. Oh, there's the dog's bed. That sucks. That was that guy that was with her at the beginning of the game. I'm pretty sure. Oh, and more. He used to be a firefly. That's kind of what this whole thing was. We find out that the guy that's with Abby. Oh, shit. shit. There's somebody on the way. I mean, I made a bunch of noises then, so I don't know. Nobody seems to care, though, so let's get going. All right, muffled voices, here I come. People don't come back from that island. How many times has Abby risked her life for you? She chose this. I'm not fucking going there. Then don't. Go back. <sighs> Fuck you, Owen. Hands up. Where's Abby? You're that girl from Jackson. Tell me where she went. How do we know you won't kill us? You give her what she wants and we're dead. You guys can survive this. I just need her. Bullshit. You. Come here. Fucking get over here! Point to where she is on this map, and then you... It better fucking match up. Okay. What are you doing? She's probably dead anyway. It is not worth Stop. it. Stop! We can talk Back about- Back the fuck up! Point to where she is. Come on, Square. Oh, Jesus.
All right, that's the second, I would guess, say, wow factor in the game so far, besides, uh, obviously, Joel's death in the beginning. But Ellie killing that guy, I guess his name was Owen. I can't remember. Uh, I, I know he had the little firefly symbol thing, but I'm guessing that was him. I was so caught up in the cutscene, I wasn't really looking at the subtitles. Um, but the fact that she was pregnant, that's the one at the very beginning of the game she goes, hey, such and such is pregnant, but we don't really know who it actually is. Uh, that was kind of crazy, so Ellie killed a pregnant lady. I mean, she did pull a knife on her, but at the same time, I feel bad because of the baby and all that. Being a brand new father myself, that's super, like, messed up. But, I don't know, I wonder if the game's doing that to try to justify... You don't want to, like, I still like Ellie, no matter what. She's been through a lot. Um, those people should have never been around Abby in the first place. And I feel like... I don't know. Right now, she's on like a revenge tour. This feels like Kill Bill all over again with, hey, anybody standing in the way is gonna... I was gonna say pay, but <laughs> that sounds like Shooter McGavin. Lay by the bay and make some hay or whatever <laughs> whatever he said. I just may. Um, but, yeah, that's... that was pretty rough. We saw Tommy, though. Where's he at? Why am I making this hard for myself? I could've just stayed around the edges. Here we go. Nah, by the time we get there, this whole area be thawed. Where are you going? Needed some air. What are you guys doing up? Couldn't sleep. Come take a look at this. Thought is to head home via Ellensburg. If we're in Falls City by tomorrow, we're doing good. Hey. They got what they deserved. But she gets to live. Yeah. Is that okay? It has to be. Mm. I'm really not looking forward to going through Idaho again. What you should be worried about is what Maria's gonna do to you when we get home. We've been through worse. <laughs> However, as I was passing through some ritzy section of town, I come across this necklace. It sparkles a lot. I think it's real gold. You think it's real gold? It's real gold. Let's see it. <laughs> I know what gold looks like. <laughs> if it's legit, can we say it's from all of us? Ha! <laughs> Find your own damn bribes. How you doing? Fine. Ellie? Fine. <sighs> Thanks for coming back for me. My friend's problems are my problems. <laughs> You're such a sap. All right, how about, uh... My friends can't get out of their own damn way. It's better. Shoot this one too. Don't you do it, Ellie. Get out of here. Stand up now. Don't you fucking dare. Shut the fuck up. Oh. Fuck. All right. Stop. Stop. Toss your weapon. Toss your weapon. Fuck. No. No. I know why you killed Joel. He did what he did to save me. There is no cure because of me. I am the one that you want. Just let him go. You killed my friends. We let you both live. And you wasted it. Come 
Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> I knew it was coming. I knew it. All right. Hold on. Four years earlier. So this would have been about the time the first game ended. Dad? She's calling for a dad. I'm guessing, I don't know, her dad, probably one of the people at that place that Joel shot up or whatever. Yo, hopefully this is just a quick little cutscene. That would be nice if it was just a little flashback. If they're trying to get me to feel bad for Abby, I will never, all right? Joel shouldn't have died. End of story. So when did she Dad, become so muscular? On. I can't keep doing this. Where where were the steroids injected? Cause she's like she's like swole in the present day or whatever. Dad Alright. Where are you? That's kinda weird. We've just spent like the last what like 12 or 13 hours playing as Ellie? I don't I don't know. I'm confused right now. Here we go. There. Dad! Where's footprints? Can I just climb? Okay. How am I getting over this fence? Can I just use my superhuman strength and get over there? Uh hold on. All the kudzu. So we're all the inventory. Hopefully this is just a quick thing, kind of like the flashbacks with Joel. Jeez. What is this? Why would I be able to pick up a bottle? Like I can't find anything in here. Oh, here we go. That worked. Can I get through here? What? Maybe I can get onto the roof. Uh, what? Am I supposed to run and jump on- Can I make this? No, there's no way. I was about to say, that's... Hold on, what? Maybe this thing moves. Here we go. Here we go. What is this? Uh, read Virginia. 1978. Right. Mountain Mama. That's West Virginia, actually. Uh, there we go. Alright, so we're gonna get on top of this roof. This thing is... I'm struggling, yo. I thought Abby was supposed to be strong. What happened here? All right. Here we go. There. You know, it kills me. She doesn't seem so bad now, but I don't... I mean, obviously, everything... Something has to go down. Can I make this? Get what you deserve. Abs? <laughs> <laughs> you, uh, you got a little mud on you there, sweetheart. So do you. Where? Right there. Oh. You know, every time you run off like this, they give me shit about it. Come on. Believe it or not, they actually care about your safety. These woods are safe. Dad. Abs, she's been hanging out right on the other side of those trees. And? She's due any day now. We'll just check on her, and then, and then we'll head back. I promise. Let's just make it quick. See? I've got my little girl to keep me safe. You know what this feels like? This feels I like... I I was here. Well, I'll tell you in a minute. Owen ratted me out, didn't he? He did his job. I swarmed to secrecy. How'd you get him to talk? Uh, I asked. Huh. You should probably cut through the playground. Hey, look what I found. Oh, wow. 1978. Don't have that one in my collection. You can keep it. If you promise not to pull anything like this again. <laughs> you got yourself a deal. Why don't I believe you? No reason I could think of. Come on, let's keep looking. 
Dad. Relax. You'll be back with Owen before you know it. Wait, what? Nothing. Just noticed you two have been hanging out a lot. More so than usual. Oh, God. Yeah. <laughs> How long have you known? I'm your dad. I see things. Like the way you both try really, really hard not to look at each other when you're around me. I can't handle this. And he makes you laugh. <laughs> That's because he's such an idiot. I just like how he's extra nice to me now. So you're taking advantage Abs, of him. Fresh tracks. Wait, this is just your sneaky way of giving me a tracking lesson, isn't it? I would never. Is it working? Well, I mean, I found you. Yeah, but you cheated. You do what you need to do to get it done. Wow. You actually listen. You have your moments of wisdom. There's some something dead over Let's here. Hold on. Can find anything else. Uh, Dad, I found something. Oh my God, she already gave birth. Ew. And look, two sets of tracks. Dad. It's her. Let's go. That doesn't sound good. No, she's in pain. All right, so she's with her dad. They're having father-daughter time, I guess. Dad. Come on. Thought for a minute they were. What if they're infected I don't know. around? This area is clear. You know they roam. You brought your gun, right? Of course. Oh shit. Abs. Oh dear. We've gotta cut her loose. That's terrible. It's okay, calm down. Don't worry. I'm not gonna hurt you. It's okay. Damn it. It's really in there. Uh, abs, come here. Alright, please stop come fighting it. Just sit okay. there and stay still. Calm down, calm down. Calm down. Here. Over here, Owen! What? Hey, get over here and help me hold her. We need you back up. At Owen! The... Hold her! Come on! Uh, All right. You got her tight? Uh, yeah. All right. Get in there, Abs. Steady. <laughs> Fuck. Everybody's looking for you. We gotta... Hey, wait! Dad! What's going on? Come on! There's the hospital in the back. Aw, oh, reunited. Get back there. Doc, that girl showed up. What girl? The one Marlene keeps talking about. They found her in the tunnels. She has an old bite mark on her arm. No signs of infection. <laughs> that can't be. They're already running tests on her, but you gotta get down there. Dad? Come on. It's intertwined with the brain. There's no other option. There has to be some other way. There's no way to remove the specimen without destroying the host. The host? She's a child, not some petri dish. You think I don't... I'm aware of the situation. And you're okay with killing her? No, I'm okay with developing a vaccine that'll help save millions of lives. How many fireflies have died for less? That was their choice. Are you asking me? Or are you telling me this is how it's gonna be? I am begging you to buy in. And what if this was Abby? 
Look, everything that we've been fighting for, all the sacrifices, all of the horrific... All of that is justified with this one act. If this was your daughter, what would you do? <laughs> Abby. I'll buy you some dinner. Thank you, sweetheart. Look, Marlene. Do it. Thank you. I'm gonna go tell Joel. Why? He traveled across the country with her. He has a right to know. Good luck with your surgery. You're doing the right thing. <gasps> yeah. If it was me, I'd want you to do the surgery. Oh, wow. Okay. It's all making sense. So, Joel killed her dad, basically. That's what this whole thing boils down to. But her dad was kind of a POS in the first place because he wanted to kill Ellie, but even though she wasn't even sick. You know, sacrificing another human. Is he still in the fucking building? Is that... Abby. No! Abby, don't look... Dad! Get up! Please stop! Please don't shoot! Joel, please get up! <laughs> no! Oh, no! <laughs> Enough. No, no, no. We're here for him. That's it. It's too risky to leave them alive. Too fucking bad. He's right. We can't have loose ends. We killed them. We're no better than he was. They didn't do anything wrong. Yeah, look at my face. Oh, fuck your face. You should have been guarding the upstairs like I told you to. Move! Back up. Calm down. Or what? Back the fuck up! Calm down! Darden! You gonna shoot me? Stop! We're done. 